All right, so today I have a kind of a cool video. I think it's going to be cool. So it is using the ChromaCraft mod. So if I just start slowly scrolling, scroll, scrolling, scrolling through my hotbar here, you can see that this is starting to update here. Um, my health is full, which is in the function for bar here. I don't know why these light up, but like these are important keys, so I guess they light up. Um, see if I hockey it. It still takes a while for it to actually update. But that's okay, and sorry if this is desynced or just a really shitty video. I've been up for the last... It's now like 11.10, and I've been trying to record this for an hour. Turns out my recording was an actual recording. Or, well, it was, but I was recording at 64 kilobits a second. Which somehow was happening. Uh, not too sure. But there's only like two things I want to show you today. One of them is me using the mod. Just gameplay. The other one's how to install it. So if I can, if I can do this part. Actually, win it. Oh, clutch. Yes. If I can do that and win the game. Uh, you have a chest plate which I need. All right. Um, let's knock it in the middle of that fight. Let's eat these apples. Someone just sent me an email. Oh, okay. It's my website telling me that things are breaking. Right, because yeah, uh, I, uh, I think I can show you a screenshot of what my thing looks like, uh, of what my email looks like. Basically, just skier dot club spamming me because a few pages are just broken. Well, there are a few legacy pages that aren't actually used anymore. They don't. Nothing leads to them. Get out of here. Oh wait, if I drink this and then jump in here, you get to see a really cool thing. Whoa. Okay. Well, you also get to see me die, but. Oh wait, that's the sweat from like three. That didn't happen at all. I, I promise that didn't happen. So let's go in here and try to get a win or so. You know what? We're gonna try for one more game to get a win. If we don't, we're just gonna. You, you saw everything the rest of the mod. It's just kind of like. Oh, I forgot to mention. Oh yeah, um, ADD boy over here. I forgot to mention that. There are uh, potion effects here. So if I drink this, you can see it. There you go. Uh, I don't think they're color coded. They might be. I looked through the code a bit, and I didn't really see much, but that's okay. It, it sent re post requests in a certain way to like a certain internal server. Please don't kill me. Please don't. Please don't stop targeting me. I know I'm your favorite Minecraft YouTuber, but you don't even target me. I might actually keep like continue to use this mod because it's actually quite fun. It's it's fun to know like I don't notice that I'm on fire a lot because I have low fire, but with this I I notice that I'm on fire because my entire keyboard just starts freaking the fuck out. There right, we go. All right, sweat, 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 sweat. I'm dead. Good game. So that is me trying to play Sky Wars and dying. Thank you for watching. That, that's the cool part. If you want to know how to install it, there'll, there'll be a thing. Since a bunch of you are going to want to know how to install it, you basically go into Razor Synapse, you click Chroma Apps, you click Visit the Chroma Workshop. That opens up a browser window thing here. That takes a while to load. But then you go down to Minecraft here, and then you click on download Chroma Sync, which I already have, so it's my second time trying to record this. So once you install it, you'll see this Chroma Sync, and then you go down to Minecraft, I already have it, so I'll just remove it. And then once you have Minecraft, once you have here, you need Forge 1.8.0 on up, I think. But don't quote me on that. So once you have that, basically just click go, and then you're good. If there's any issues, I can try to help you, but I'm not really sure if I can help you solve them because I didn't make the mod.